Hey there guys, what's going on? So we're kind of uh, at the end of the week here now and um, we're in a little bit of a different position than I sort of expected when it came to some of the releases for this week. Um, if you're kind of on top of things, you'll know that uh, David Byrne and St. Vincent dropped on Tuesday. Uh, you had Amanda Palmer and the Grand Theft Orchestra drop on Tuesday. Um, just a lot of different little things going on all at once. Um, a lot of things that I've been trying to put together uh, kind of in just a big old whirlwind of activity. It's taking a little time, but it's gradually building up, and that's been, you know, really, really excellent. Um, unfortunately, there has been some setback in terms of the unboxing videos I wanted to do this week. Um, I actually kind of thought there would be some different things, uh, some kind of bigger things, really, that would be coming out that I would be able to do some quick unboxing videos for, uh, kind of get them out there, get some interest going and uh, you know just put some interesting content up um, but unfortunately a lot of the stuff that I planned on really didn't end up coming uh, for whatever reason I believe there was a delay with one of them and the other one might just be not quite ready yet um, so we've had to change plans a little bit change some things up and with the release of the last video that should be coming out before this one, if I time this accordingly, um, it felt like the right sort of companion piece because while I didn't get what I was hoping for today, um, I did get a pretty nice little, uh, little vinyl package courtesy of Merge Records here. So I thought to myself, you know, this might not be the most big and intricate thing I could put together to give and present to you, the viewer, um, but I thought, you know, I really dug this record. Um, if you watch my review, which will be going along with this, you'll know that I, I really had a good time with it. I definitely um, was in new territory, a new kind of territory, but I really uh, did enjoy myself with it. So I thought, you know, since Merge threw in a couple of bonuses, why not do a little bit of a uh, an unboxing of sorts on this, where you can actually see my face as opposed to just the uh, camera on the table kind of look. I thought I'd do just uh, sort of a quick thing on it. So. Without further ado here, we have Bob Mould with Silver Age, and uh, of course, the cover, and the back side with all the uh, the 10 songs on it, with all these different uh, symbols on there. Uh, I'm not quite sure what these are or what they're supposed to represent. If uh, anybody out there has a more informed idea of what they are, please do uh, let me know because I'm not quite sure what these are supposed to mean. The front almost looked a little bit like an astrological symbol, but nothing seemed to match up. So I'm a little curious about that. And we'll go inside here. This is actually the uh, the first time I'm looking at pretty much any of this since I got it today. And inside here we have Bob Mould, definitely looking, definitely looking a little angry, a little ready to deliver some rage your way, some uh, some glorious rage perhaps. But you know, looking good. And uh, on the back here, we have all the lyrics for the songs, which um, I was definitely very, very curious about, as you can see here. And uh, inside, we have a pretty nice little uh, standard 12-inch there. I mean, nothing too, uh, you know, nothing too crazy, nothing too out of the ordinary, but uh, feels pretty solid. Nothing too uh, springy and ineffective, I suppose. So that is that right there. I'm definitely looking forward to a very loud and very chaotic listen to that later. There were also some uh, some quick credits and who produced what, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, on the other side there. And uh, the reason I just really quickly included this, a quick unboxing video, um, is because of the stuff that Merge Records did throw in that I really wasn't even aware they were going to throw in. Uh, starting with a nice little uh, Merge Records sampler here, which is a pretty neat way to get introduced to all their artists. You have uh, you have Red Cross, you have Imperial Teen, you have the Magnetic Fields, which I've heard of, uh, Hospitality, Sugar, Bob Mould's band from Copper Blue, one of their songs from Copper Blue, uh, M. Ward, from a really fine record, of course, if you've uh, been watching my channel, from A Wasteland Home Companion, uh, Times New Viking, uh, Stephen Merritt, Eleanor Friedberger, Lamb Chop, Archers of Loaf, Crooked Fingers, and uh, the supergroup uh, Wild Flag is also on here. So that's pretty cool. Nice little uh, mix of some different artists to get you acquainted with some of the people on the Merge roster. I gotta say, that's that should be a necessary throw-in for pretty much any label, trying to get some of its artists out there. Um, you have this neat little, um, what looks like an iron-on patch of some kind, I'm guessing. 
Uh, I'll get a positive confirmation on that. I'm not quite sure how I'm going to use that yet, but I really do dig that. And uh, lastly, of course, if you've uh, seen enough of the videos of the different things that I've done here in my room, you'll know that I'm a bit of a poster aficionado with all the different things that I've ordered and uh, received over time. So this is definitely going to fit in somewhere very, very well, I think. Uh, that will definitely be a very nice little addition to my room of music nerdery. And um, that is pretty much it right there. I uh, really didn't do a vinyl review on the Bob Mold record because this didn't come until today. Like I said, the timing has all just sort of been kind of screwy lately with some things, but uh, I did get it today and uh, it is very cool looking as you can see. So think of this as like my little impromptu vinyl side review along with my thoughts on the digital side of things which will be coming out right alongside with this. So enjoy that little, uh, that little installment in two parts with my thoughts on Bob Mold and Silver Age and uh, enjoy the stuff that will be also out with it and some of the great stuff that we've got coming out uh, going into next week and some interesting footage that should hopefully also be uh, rolling out with some of the stuff going on this weekend. Uh, it's going to be a pretty chaotic time, but hopefully uh, with any luck, videos will continue to be churned out um, as we head into next week with Grizzly Bear, with Shields, um, a Menomina perhaps, with Moms. Um, there's a few other possibilities in there, but uh, we're just going to have to see where it takes us. So until next time, guys, keep your music flowing and your vinyl spinning. I'll see you all very, very soon.